Good morning, loved ones, to this Saturday the 13th video devotion for a hymn history. And this is a recent one. We've been on a little bit lately of a theme about heaven and that we have our eyes set on the Lord, where he is in heaven, where our ultimate home is going to be. That gives us endurance to put up with the crud in this life, particularly pandemics and stupid politicians. It seems like almost everyone is a stupid politician these days. But loved ones, we need to be reminded of our home and of Jesus who's in our home. Just this week, Brother Nathan and I were at the funeral of Brother Amos Tillis, a preacher in this area for many, many years. And at his funeral, he spoke about heaven. Well, someone who's uh, just about 70 years of age and not long ago wrote a song. He's still alive today, and it's sung many a time. It's called Sweet Beulah Land by Squire Parsons. I'm kind of homesick for a country to which I've never been before. I hope you're homesick there. That means you're longing. That's where your treasure is, and your heart will be also. No sad goodbyes will there be spoken, for time won't matter anymore. We're going to be there forever, and God wipes away all tears. I'm looking now across the river where my faith will end in sight. What we see right now isn't reality. What is unseen right now is reality and is what is eternal. There's just a few more days to labor, then I'll take my heavenly flight. Loved ones, let's be faithful for those few more days to labor. I see the lights. I hear the singing. And we can imagine what that singing is like when we read the book of Revelation, chapters 4 and 5, and other chapters there. A brand new song of joy divine. My soul rejoices just in knowing that soon these pleasures will be mine. And all of those pleasures are wrapped up in one person. His name is Jesus. The thing that makes heaven heaven is Jesus Christ. Without him, all of those things would be nothing. Beulah land, I'm longing for you. Because that's where Jesus is. We're longing for him. And someday on you I'll stand where my home shall be eternal. Sweet Beulah land. Beulah means married. We'll be finally united. Loved ones, let's labor faithfully for that day, putting up with whatever difficulties, because we know we're going to be united with him. Remember when you got married to your spouse, those of you who are married? There were difficulties before you got married. Yes, since we're sinners, there's been difficulties after we've been married too. But you can hardly wait for that day. May that longing be ours, and may it inspire and motivate us to put up with the difficulties so that we won't be discouraged because we know we're going to be united with our groom, Jesus Christ. Let's bow for prayer. Father, I pray that you would help us to be motivated and to long for you because you are our treasure who is up in heaven. And may we labor faithfully till that day you call us there. In your Son's name, 